So I take the skibbly and so I take home day. So we're going to be doing just a word for the day, word of the day, and etymologizing it right up here on my whiteboard in my living room because I'm a psychopath, apparently, according to my audience that thinks that it's weird to have a whiteboard in my dining room. That's okay. We'll do psychopath at another time. Addiction is what we're going to focus on here. Three parts to this word. Odd plus dick plus T-I-O and the action of. This is going to be the English suffixification, basically always referring to that action of. It makes it into either a verb, a noun, or an adjective, or an adverb, depending on what that suffixification is. You can be an addict, or you can be addicted, or you can have an addiction. So addiction is going to be the noun form here. Basically, the act of having been spoken. Dico de care in Latin means to speak, the past participial form, having been spoken. And in this case, when we etymologize, we go from the suffix back to the prefix to odd here. Odd meaning to or towards, a dynamic preposition in Latin, meaning motion towards, associated with the accusative case, because we have prepositions in Latin associated with either the accusative case or ablative. And those ablative case um, prepositions are going to be called static versus dynamic here. So when again, etymologizing addiction, we have the action of having been spoken towards, and in this case, whatever you're addicted to. I was talking to some people about homelessness and how I have such a huge heart for the homeless population because of what they have to go through. Addiction is such a cyclical cycle. And imagine not having the support to get you off the streets. I mean, think about it. All these people that are on the streets have a cyclical cycle. They have an addiction that they have to fulfill because they're having being spoken towards whatever that is. They go throughout their days in order to fulfill that addiction to just again do it the next day around. And then it becomes that perpetual cycle that keeps them stuck and embedded within the streets. So if you learned something new, would really appreciate support anywhere and everywhere. I have a podcast. I do this on a longer format. Latin and Layman's Rhetoric Revolution in my show notes and or right below. Uh, trying to get better at this YouTube thing. Anyways, yeah. Hope you learned something new. Consider tipping me a Ko-Fi, anything and everything. Tempest has to schedule.